Welcome, 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 welcome to another episode of 3D Boxing Podcast. We are back with another episode of Quick Hits. Uh, we are, I was on early today on uh, my podcast, Mixed Combat Radio with Matt the Hipster Hunter. Uh, go check that out. And I'm back for my second show today with Quick Hits. Um, we're going to talk about Manny Pacquiao's last fight, potentially Manny Pacquiao versus Terrence Crawford, what he wants uh, as far as economics are concerned, uh, what he wants as far as money. Uh, but before we get into that, please like and subscribe, share on all forms of social media. Get quick hits comes at you twice a day, two episodes a day, every day, six days a week, and seven day a week we do one show. Um, but if that's the kind of content you want, you want to be kept concurrently up to date at all times in the boxing world, please like and subscribe, um, share with a friend, and share on all forms of social media. All right, let's get into it. Like I said, today's episode is going to be a about and we, I think we did a pretty good job covering this on the podcast. So go check it. out. I'm going to put a link in the description below. Um, I think we did a pretty good. Me Hunter, me and the hipster Hunter did a pretty good job breaking this down on our podcast. Um, on on, on MCR podcast, um, Pacquiao wants forty million dollars for Bud Crawford. Um, let's get into that. Is that a serious thing? You know, I, I made it to an, you know, I likened it to an analogy where somebody puts an absurd price tag on their home, and if somebody wants my home, you know, that badly, and they're willing to pay that price, well, I'll sell it then, right? Like, I think, and I've been saying it for a while, Pacquiao is done. He's not going to fight Ryan Garcia in a real fight. Um, he's basically more or less all done with big fights, I believe. Unless you can give him forty million dollars, um, if he, if you can throw forty million at him, perhaps he'll take it. I, but I, in reality, I, I don't think he's going to fight him because I don't think Top Rank will offer him forty million. Top Rank seems to be penny pinching right now. Uh, they don't want to pay um, Tiafimo Lopez one point two five million to fight his mandatory, which is Cambosis. Um, they don't seem like they want to be throwing money around right now. They have an eighty seven million dollar budget. It's been, we're we're going to get back to that in just a second. Um, they don't. Uh, they, they, the the TV Lopez Cambosis fight is actually going to purse bids. Um, I think Eddie Hearn is going to take that. We'll probably do a show on that tomorrow. You guys want to do a show on that tomorrow? I'll do a show on that. Uh, TV Lopez uh, and, and Cambosis tomorrow. And what I think is going to happen with that. But uh, spoiler, I think it's going to uh, match. I think Eddie Hearn's going to stop and I'm buy that if, if it does indeed go to purse bids. Which, Looks like it is. Um, but this fight, look, Pacquiao says he wants $40 million. That's a lot of money. That's the beginning of negotiations. He said, I'll take 40, give Crawford 10. Again, don't worry about what, what's inside Crawford's pocket, right? Like, just keep your, keep your mind, keep your eyes, keep your focus on your own dang pocket. That's what I would say to Pacquiao. That's a $50 million pot. Um, like I said, ESPN has a 80 million 87 million dollar total purse you know total allotment they're allowed um through espn this would 50 million would be well more than half of that you're not getting that here's what i would say i will do a 40 million dollar pot 30 million to pack out 10 million to crawford who's gonna say no it's less than look Top rank don't want to spend money on anything else. They don't want to spend money on Shakur Stevens. They don't want to spend money on Tiafimo Lopez, right? So what do you want to do exactly? So make this fight. Because I, I I think you have a real chance. I'm going to get into that tomorrow. So losing Tiafimo, Tiafimo Lopez. Um, so make this fight. It, keep Crawford happy. Get him away. Get him $10 million. Look, you give Pacquiao $30 million. He says he wants 40. That's negotiation. I will give you 30, not a dime more, and you'll take it. I'll give Crawford 10. That's a $40 million pot. It goes on pay-per-view. I don't know what it does. 700,000 pay-per-view buys. We can come up with numbers on that. Seven, 
you know, whatever that, that is. It, it could bring in $50 million in revenue to a pay-per-view buys. I would say make the fight. Give them 30, 10, make it happen. You have the revenue, you have, you know, you, you can make it happen. You don't have anything else, and you're not willing to spend any money. So make Crawford happy. Crawford will win, and it'll be the biggest win of Crawford's career. If you want the Spence fight on your terms, go beat Pacquiao. Right? Because Crawford doesn't deserve a 50 50 split right now. It's Spence fight. Spence has better wins. He's done better numbers, right? <laughs> I I get Crawford. Um, is the number one pound for pound star according to ESPN, number one in the world by ESPN pound for pound. I don't have him that high on the list. I have him at three. I still have him up above Spence, but Spence has the numbers. Spence has proven he can sell pay per views. Crawford has Crawford's done two pay per views and they've done a total of two hundred thousand. Spence is uh, Crawford, Spence is on three pay per views and they've done almost a million combined. Right. Fight Pacquiao. It'll do seven to seven hundred thousand pay per views at least. I think it does really well. And then you have negotiation room, and then then you can demand that you're the A side in the in the Crawford fight. But you're not getting that unless this happens first. So make this happen. And it looks like uh, Spence is going to fight Ugas right now. So you got two choices. They don't want to give Porter two million. That's the other fight top right doesn't want to pay. They don't want to pay Spence. Uh, they don't want to pay Porter two or three million. Like they, they just don't want to pay anything. So you, you you have this pot, right? You 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 have this allotment from ESPN, eighty something million. I, I mean, you don't get to save it, right? You don't get to keep it in your pocket. If you don't spend it at the end of the year. So spend it on this. I, I don't know what else to tell you. What, what, what are you going to get, Guido Vianello, ten million? I mean, you don't you don't have a whole lot left. I'm sure you're paying Herring and Frampton, okay? But I mean, that's not making a dent into this. So go get this fight. If you get this fight, you can establish Terrence Crawford as that star. Terrence Crawford's best win right now would be what, Gamboa or Jeff Horn? You know what I mean? Like, uh, from, from, from a name, I know hardcore will say Postal, and I, I think the Postal win was incredible, but from, from a name, like his best wins are Gamboa and Jeff Horn. You got to do better than that, right? And this is the opportunity. It's going to cost you $40 million, but it's an investment within your own fighter. I don't think Top Rank wants to do that because they don't want to invest in their own fighters for some reason. I don't understand why they haven't made TFD with Lopez a star. But I would say make this fight. If I'm, if I'm Top Rank, I make this fight for $40 million. I, I'll offer Pacquiao 30 and I'll offer Corporate 10. Corporate, don't argue about taking short money. You're getting $10 million. Your contract only gives you four, right? Like your, your standard pay is for you're getting 10. Don't worry about it. Take the 10. Be happy with the 10. Let me know what you guys think. Um, and do you think it's short money? Do you think if uh, you gave forty, uh, if you gave thirty to Pacquiao and ten to, to Crawford, is that short money for Crawford? Is that disrespectful to Crawford? Um, if, if it is, what other fight is Crawford getting more than ten million for? Assuming the Spence fight doesn't happen, he's not getting ten million guaranteed for the for the Spence fight. This is the fight you can make. Um, let me know what you guys think. Leave your thoughts, comments below. Remember, Quick Hits comes at you twice a day. We'll be back tomorrow. We'll do one show on TV. I don't know what we'll do the other one on yet. Um, but like and subscribe. Um, hit the uh, smash the thumbs up button. Uh, share on all forms of social media. Um, it is February 15th, 2021. Ivan Calderon is still not in the Boxing Hall of Fame. We need to make that change. Uh, get Iron Boy into the Boxing Hall of Fame class of 2021 from Texas to the world. Thank you and God. Don't miss a tweet, post, story, or video. 3D Boxing is on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Hit the subscribe button now to stay inside the ring.